hello guys welcome to solving solutions to number one channel where i get solutions to all your solving problems it's nice having you in class again today how have you been on today's tutorial we are going to show you how to use um qgis to convert um autocad drawings in dxf to shape files right good so we add a request so we come to layer add layer and then add vector layer right so under the data source manager we browse good so we have navigated to the folder we have what the dxf file plot we open it up we add yeah that's the entity a line string and then we close so we have what the autocad file imported to qgis however it is not assigned with what um, a code reference system yet so from the um xy data that was used it's actually in um, zone 32 right good so we click on this so you can actually search for whatever zone your maybe your data falls in the projected crs right good so most times it's actually projected so as the same zone 32 so we click on ok so it has actually been moved to wherever it's supposed to be so we can zoom to layer and then it's falling where it's supposed to fall right good so um you can decide to change the current crs the current crs is still in um wgs 84 because i saw the same um, epsg 44326 right good so it's not in the projected so if we apply click on ok you can now see that the coordinates because if you can just then rewind you can see the coordinates here earlier we are um latitude and longitude coordinates right good so we had to change what the current crs of the qgis project so that the coordinates will now look like what we have here in the what in the coordinates um the drawing coordinates right good so this is another way to actually check whatever you have done good so if you have a base map you can actually overlay it so let's come to web quick map and um, services um google hybrid or google satellite whatever you want to use good so it has um, been navigated to the location of what that plot right good so yours might be in a developed area maybe just a piece of land that you will have solved it but you just want to confirm um, where it falls and then you can proceed with that right good now after you have um, validated your your drawing on the base map you can now and decide to convert it to the shape file so you right click export save features as then in the save vector layer as window you select what um, s3 shape file there are other vector data formats so you confirm the crs which is projected then you indicate the file name good so we have navigated to the folder so we can still call this plot right and then we click on save every other parameter is set so we click on ok so it has been what um converted to what a ship file we can confirm from the folder you can see the folder shp and then you can easily what drag this and then drop on autocad right so we have both of them overlaying each other so thanks for coming to class we hope we have shown you exhaustively how to move autocad file from yeah from autocad to ship file and using qgis as what as the medium right good also how to change what the project crs and then maybe overlaying whatever data you have on the base map so that you can validate what you have so we are going to see you on the next tutorial ensure you keep staying safe and have a very good time bye